Yale president reportedly says school not considering name change despite namesake's ties to slave DR. To view the full article, click the first link in the description below. Yale University's president reportedly told Yale Daily News last week the officials are not considering changing the Ivy League school's name, despite its namesake's ties to the 17th century slave trade. Calls to rename the university have circulated on the Internet amid ongoing protests and demonstrations following the death of George Floyd in Minneapolis police custody last month. Over the weekend, Senator Ted Cruz, Republican Texas, responded to Princeton dropping former President Woodrow Wilson's name from its public policy school and a residential college by tweeting, Yale founded by slave trader Elihu Yale changes its name to College of New Haven in 3, 2, 1. Senator Hawley Yale Law School should be stripped of federal funding for religious intolerance earlier this month, conservative author Ann Coulter wrote an online column titled, Yale Has to Go. How about a bill withholding all federal funds from Yale University until it changes its name? The school's namesake, Elihu Yale, was not only a slave owner, but a slave trader, she said, in comments that were perceived by some as a swipe at liberals who have called for such name changes in the wake of Floyd's death. Quite a dilemma for the little snots who attend and teach there. It will be tremendously damaging to their brand. In 2017, Yale renamed Calhoun College to Grace Hopper College, in honor of the pioneering computer scientist who earned a Ph.D. from the university. The decision to change a college's name is not one we take lightly, but John C. Calhoun's legacy as a white supremacist and a national leader who passionately promoted slavery as a positive good fundamentally conflicts with Yale's mission and values, Yale President Peter Salovey said at the time. John Wood. A Yale grad who heads Davenport College and led the committee that recommended renaming Calhoun College, told the Yale Daily News that Elihu Yale, an East India company. To view the full article, click the first link in the description below.